Susan Burnell's story is one of inspiration from tragedy. My husband and I were pregnant with our um, second child, just about starting our life together. One morning he woke up with a backache and his little backache turned into a um, dissecting aortic aneurysm uh, from which he suffered a 13-month illness and um, eventually passed away. Newly married, Susan was now faced with the reality of her husband's unexpected death. Adding to the strain, Susan was already mother to a toddler and had another baby on the way. For most, it's unimaginable. And yet for Susan Burnell, in that devastation, she found a calling. That experience um, brought me to what nursing was all about. And the nurses that cared for my husband were my uh, family and they took care of him and myself and my children in a way that I can't even explain. And I knew after that experience that nursing was the career for me. But the road ahead would have its challenges. Dwayne Burnell's battle lasted 13 months, leaving Susan with memories, photos, and two very special children. The entire length of his illness, and even right after he died, I could not figure out why this happened to my family. I was an instant widowed parent, taking care of a toddler and an infant, and it was horrible. I couldn't figure out why this happened to me. I just had a lot of questions. I was angry, I was sad. Um, it was very hard taking care of my children by myself. But I am fortunate enough now to realize that that entire experience was the reason that I am a nurse today. And I honor him every day in caring for my patients here. Duane spent four months in the intensive care unit at Salinas Valley Memorial. Here, a highly trained team works with the most seriously ill patients. In them, Susan saw her future. They um, cared for him in a way that I, I was amazed at how they didn't know him at all, but treated him like he was how I would have cared for him at home. Susan Burnell found inspiration and strength to move forward from her time with the ICU nursing staff at Salinas Valley Memorial Hospital. Today, she has been a level two staff nurse for three years in the 26-bed ICU step-down unit, also known as the Progressive Care Unit. She has earned her BSN and is working on her Staff Nurse 3 project. She makes time to be a volunteer bereavement facilitator for hospice and runs a support group for young families who have lost a parent. Those nurses were the reason that I'm here today. They taught me how to care for a patient in a way where I believe that that patient is my family member. And I respect their, the family's wishes and beliefs. I chose SVMH over the other hospitals in the area, specifically because of the level of support that they give their nurses. The level of education and professional development is by far, it goes above and beyond what I had ever even imagined that this place could be. She, she helps us with our homework and she's really smart. So she got to nursing school and graduated. I'm very proud of my mom. I'm really proud of my mom too.